Today in this video, we're going to be robbing the Diamond Casino in GTA Online. This week in GTA Online, the Diamond Casino is going to give you 50% more money for completing the heist finale. So I'm going to get some more money this week for robbing the casino. And without further ado, let's just jump into it. Okay, so we've already scoped out the casino since I've done this before. Now we got to scope out the vault contents. All right, so I found the security guard. So I just need to hack the security guard's phone. All right, so we hacked into the security guard's phone. And now we just need to go to the casino. All right, so now we can access the security cam. So let's see what is inside the vault this time. And we have cash. We have cold hard cash that we are going to be stealing today from the Diamond Casino. Okay, so the last time I did this heist, I did it on aggressive. I wasn't even planning on doing it aggressively again. I was kind of hoping to do the big con. With the big con, I think there's a lot more security this time around than the last time I did it as the big con. Just because, just because I did it so somewhat recently so i'm just gonna do it silent and sneaky hopefully this could work all right so with this entire screen i'm pretty much gonna do the bare minimum okay so we're gonna do the micro smg loadout so let's just go get that all right so we have to find noose fans and we have to search the noose fans for weapons so hopefully hopefully i can do this in a quickly manner but this could take a little while all right what do we have in this noose van it better be my weapon and there is nothing in there. Lovely. Ah, here's another noose van right here. All right, it is in here. Well, let me just take this van and let's just bring it back to my arcade and we should be good. All right, and there we go. We just delivered the weapons to the arcade. All right, so now we just need to go get our getaway vehicle. So let's just go get that. All right, so we made it to Sandy Shores Airfield. So now we just need to get the getaway vehicle. All right, I was finally able to get one of the getaway vehicles right here. Let's just take this vehicle to the arcade and then let's just get the other vehicle. Yeah, this setup is probably so much easier and so much quicker to do with two people because you have to get two getaway vehicles. And well, there's only one of me. It's going to be a lot longer for me to get two getaway vehicles. If you have someone around, I would recommend do this set up with someone else but if you don't then it's just gonna be a little longer okay, i delivered one vehicle i just need to get the other one i finally got my second getaway vehicle they literally drove all the way to Polito bay it's crazy they weren't even going that way when i stole the first car they were going towards los santos all right so i delivered the second getaway vehicle to the arcade that took way longer than i thought it would Honestly, it probably took as long as it did just because I probably got the best getaway vehicle. All right, so now it's time to get the hacking device. Let's go do that. Okay, so we need to go get like a key card or something. All right, and we just took out the agent. Let's get the agent's access card. All right, let's go on in. Oh, dear Lord, not this place again. I just did this for the doomsday heist. I'm not a fan of this really not a fan of this place oh my god the hacking device was right there dude no one told me i could have used the sightseer app just to try to locate it a little bit easier i was just going around the entire facility i could not find it at all oh my god i wasted probably i don't know like 20 minutes i think that was 20 minutes of me trying to find it i'm an idiot all right so now we gotta find these drones and i think we just gotta take out these drones all right there we go shot down one nano drone and there we go i guess we can just blow it up and then lester is smart enough to build it right back together all right, there we go shot down another drone and here are the drone parts three more to go i right, shot down another drone two more drone pieces to go another drone shot down now we just need to collect one more drone and we should be good all right there we go last drone has been taken out and there we go that is all the drone pieces really I had, a, I had a feeling that was a stupid idea to park the oppressor right next to the burning vehicle. I, I, I just had a feeling. It just didn't click in my head, though, for some reason. All right, so now we need to go get the vault laser. So we just need to get the vault laser, which apparently is in the Grand Sonora Desert. I don't know why there's a vault laser in the Grand Sonora Desert. Oh, good. Oh, good. I have to get two of these. I just realized that. I got to get two of these, kind of like how I did with the vehicles. All right, so I found one of the vault lasers. I just need to go back to my arcade and then i guess come back here and get the other vault laser all right well i just delivered one of the vault lasers i think i just gotta go back and get the other vault laser all right there we go i found the second vault laser i just need to deliver it back to the arcade and this setup will be complete 
Alright, so now we need to steal the vault key cards from some security guards. So let's just go steal it off of them. Okay, so apparently one of the security guards is inside of this motel. Yeah, according to Lester, he's having a nice time. So let's just ruin let's ruin his nice time. Dude, why is Oh, oh you want a fist fight, huh? Oh bop. Yeah, ah. Ooh, yeah, you thought. You thought. Look at that. Yeah, you're done. You're done. Try to box me? No. I'm just gonna just whip your butt. Alright, so this security guard is apparently incredibly drunk. Oh, yeah, this guy, I can just... I can just do that. Come on, can you die already? There we go. Okay, so I just beat that guy to death, and now I got his key card. I purchased two of the heist preps, the optional heist preps. I'm gonna do one more. I'm gonna do the patrol route so I have an idea of where all the security guards are at the casino. So I'm gonna do that real quick. All right, so I found the vehicle and we're just opening up the trunk and I'm supposed to take a picture of the roster right there, boom. And there we go, lost the cops. Heist prep complete. Now we have the guard patrol routes and I think we're ready for the heist finale. All right, here we go. We are gonna start up the sneaky and silent method of the diamond casino heist. All right, so we made it to the casino. So now let's just make our way in. We have to take out one camera and that's pretty much it and we should be good. So here's the camera right here. So that camera is knocked out. Now let's just swipe in. And now let's just enter the casino. All right, here we are. We are in the casino now. Let's take that out. Let's walk in. Very nice. Okay, so we made our way through, or I made my way through. I don't know where my teammate is, to be honest. Nope, he's being stupid. What are you doing? You were born with a head. Please use it. You're an embarrassment. All right, can you please be smart this time, teammate? I really would like you to be smart this time. See, look, okay, you do this. Bang, bang, bang. Look, they're dead. We go over here. Hello, bang, dead. Okay, then we go over here, go over here, dead. Then I swipe into here. We go inside here, and then we wait. Teammate, don't be stupid. No, no, uh-uh, mm -mm, mm -mm. you're not doing that. No, no, wrong, wrong. That is not what you do. Good Lord, why? I swear, I get paired up with the dumbest people. I. It's probably honestly my fault because I, I allowed a guy named XX Bill Cosby to join, but I mean, whatever. We wait for that security guard right there because that security guard is heavily, heavily armored. We are not, no, no. Bop. There we go. That's what you do. You go down the steps. Steps, steps. Steps are nice. We need to burn some calories. Steps. We go with steps. Bop. There we go. Dead. Okay, there we go. Stun the camera. So we're good there. You got the wrong guy. You got the wrong guy. Well, why'd you quit? If you're gonna be dumb, you might as well just be dumb on any other game. Don't waste my time. The random people I'm playing with are being a little bit difficult. So for my next video, I'm going to do the heist finale then. Make sure you check out this video right here if you want to see me play Gerald Missions in GTA Online so you do not have to.